Hey guys, Mikey's back with another video. Today we have the bad ratings on Amazon, this speaker, right? The Dev Bonds Quaxel speaker versus Kicker CS 46CS 6x9 speaker, right? We're going to compare to two different speakers. Uh, this is highly rated. You guys destroying to buy these uh, Kicker speakers. And I'm going to say why you stay away from this speaker, why you should buy it from speaker. I'm running these both speakers from cheap Amazon head unit. So make sure I'm going to give you the accurate measurements, all that stuff, right? So what's going to happen if you guys install these speakers on your vehicle on the factory unit, right? So these uh, the head units surprisingly sounds good. It's going to put up around 20 watts uh, RMS power. So it, it's going to get loud. So... Actually, this one just sounds a little bit better than any, you know, Honda, Toyota's uh, head units, right? So if you replace them, you're going to see, surprisingly. I thought that I just bought for the cheap, you know, to, to run is going to show you, like, a, how the speaker is bad. But when I'm running, I by mistake get a really nice one. Uh, and I got lucky. You're going to see how uh, these everything moves. Like, this works flawlessly. It's surprisingly first time from China, this kind of head unit. So... Kicker advertise 150 watt RMS power and 450 watt maximum power, right? Def wants advertise 200 watt RMS power and the 400 watts maximum power. Surprisingly, both speakers are different animals. Kickers will play from 30 hertz. It's a lot bassy speaker, goes to up to 20,000 hertz. Def wants only one tweeter. The kicker is three way. Def wants a two way and plays from 80 hertz this is a mid-range speaker there is no bass and goes to 20,000 hertz so clarity you don't you have a two tw tweeters here you have a single tweeter and we're gonna run the side by side so i switch the wires like a left and right left and right i thought so some head units always like you have a left channel is cleaner than a right channel right channel is diff louder than left channel but on this one it's just you know the both channels the same so i'm gonna balance uh, between the two speakers right so let, let's play some music i'm gonna play some more music and you guys can just comment below us what you guys think which one is plays nicer you can see which side i'm moving right so this speaker is playing right So right away, as you can see, the kicker, of course, uh, playing the 30 hertz. So it's produced a lot of bass, uh, not a lot. Like it's not significantly like deep bass, like a uh, how's the uh, Infinity Cap has produced, but the decent bass. Even the stock head unit, you're gonna have nice, nice bass, right? We're gonna play the uh, the bass, all that stuff. So don't don't rush, right? Let me play a different music. All right, we're gonna go to a little bit louder, 50 percent volume. Guys, please use your headphones because the, on your, when, when you're watching on your phones or laptop, it's not going to give you a lot, of, a lot of, you know, difference. But when you're using the decent headphones, definitely you're going to hear it because I'm recording with the HD microphones, HD system. So uh, definitely you're going to hear if you have headphones.
as you can see of course the base on the kicker it's a lot nicer and deeper tone of course because it's placed from 30 hertz to you know 20,000 hertz but on the twitter on the dev bonds this is a pro audio a lot of guys like complaining on the amazon when you see the reviews like bad reviews nothing to do with the speaker itself you can see the magnet size right you can see this is a pro audio so it has to this this speaker plays twice louder than this speaker even the 200 like only the 50 watts rms difference right 150 watt rms 200 watt rms only complain even i receive you, you see the grill is nice quality grill but it's got damage to once the transportation i fix it so the packaging and the transportation when you get uh, you're gonna have damage and this is a kicker's grill all right as you can see def one's grill is a lot nicer like expensive looks expensive but when you add it kickers uh, exposed to tweeters on the def ones it's gonna be twitter slot so let, let's play the different music guys we're gonna play a lot of music we're gonna give a lot of As you can see, after like 80% 80, 80 volume, it's get the distortion because it's not the distortion from the speakers. Those speakers will handle way more power than these uh, tiny guys produce. But it's still, if you update this uh, tiny head unit with the speakers, you're gonna get the decent sound, right? Right away, it's gonna be sounding nicer. But next video, I'm gonna install amplifier and amplify these speakers, and you're gonna see the difference, right? It's gonna be way louder. These speakers gonna be like rock and roll like crazy with the bass. Now they, they, they don't even move, right? But they did producing uh, still uh, nice sounds. Uh, watch my previous video. I did the uh, reviews each each speaker uh, separately. And let's play the different music. Even this cheap head unit, you see that? <laughs> this place is nice, nice sound. So nice. It's it's better than head unit, right? Imagine four of these kind of speakers, like a two on the doors, two in the back, or two in the front doors. You're gonna have a really, really nice sound. So now back to the side by side. Devmas uh, 200 watt RMS power. Of course, you need the amplifier. Uh, if you running these speakers without the subwoofer. Um, you, 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 you gotta be crazy, right? You don't run these speakers without a subwoofer. These speakers doesn't meant any bass at all. 80 hertz is the mid range, so you have to tune these speakers not like these.
you shouldn't tune your speaker not like this like bass and clarity right these speakers has to be this 80 hertz starts from here and goes like that no these parts has to go all the way down all right and you gotta go up 80 hertz so these speakers you can run like that what is from the 30 hertz you gotta run like this right this part has to go all the way down right something like that these speakers so produce the bass so if you don't have any subwoofers and little tiny amplifier go ahead with the kickers or the stockhead unit all that stuff go with the kickers if you don't have any amplifiers you want to just run the 6x9 and you want to try to get the depth ones please don't do it only use with the amplifier next video i'm going to amplify these speakers and i'm going to show you how much louder this speaker can get how much cleaner even the loud sound when you tune when you give the clear music on the, for, for this speaker so all the bs um, the reviews on amazon for the deaf ones though those are the guys doesn't know nothing about the speakers and they put the one star because they really smashed right so yeah watch my other videos guys if you didn't subscribe to my channel definitely subscribe i want to do a lot of comparison like this expensive versus cheap cheap versus expensive so on and so on as you can see a bit of built and fit and finish for the both speakers are crazy watch my other playlist i did a tons of video about these speakers like with the amplifier without the amplifier and give you best product for your hard-earned cash right i'm out also in the next video guys